As you may know, in addition to continually offering new yarn collections and colors, we release a new knit or crochet pattern every Friday and sometimes more. So I thought it would be a blast to show you all of the patterns that we released this year. If you are new and you would love to get our future patterns for free, just head on over to expressionfiberarts.com and sign up for email updates. You'll get all of the patterns straight to your inbox when they go live, and they're only free for a limited time, so you don't want to miss out. And if you've been with us for a while, after you watch the video, comment and let me know how many of these you downloaded this year. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start with January. We began with the beautiful Leto, which is inspired by a cornfield on a summer day. Then we had the gorgeous Giselle, and then the cozy home socks made in a fun speckled sock yarn. After that, we released the gorgeous Ember's shawl, which really looks like shifting firelight. And then we reworked the beautiful Emma hat. And then finally, we had a cozy Allium set, which included wrist warmers, a cowl, and a headband. For February, we started off with the shimmering and beaded fluorescence shawl, and I really love the edging on this one. After that, we had the striking lumen shawl, which is just absolutely breathtaking on every level. After that came the gorgeous unencumbered cowl, and you know I love a huge cowl. Then we had the Parisian river-inspired sensation with its gorgeous ebbs and flows. We showed an updated version of the Lakin shawl, and then finished off the month with our cozy Elan sweater. March started off with a bang with the Tubusake with its beautiful hexagons, lacy border, and yes, beads. Reveil was next, which is a beautiful triangle shawl with simple stitching and gorgeous little tassels. Mindfulness was next, a huge cozy cowl, a pattern designed to help you calm your mind and enjoy the moment. Then we released Alchemy, designed to remind you that you can change your circumstances and then a beautiful remake of West King, which is just loaded with all kinds of stitch patterns. The first pattern we released in April was Terabinthia, a beautiful lacy design with loads of beads. Next was the beautiful and versatile Embrasser designed to wrap you in coziness in so many different ways. Then we had the super cute Panapea top, followed by the Harmonious Shawl, which is just knit stitches and a really fun technique to create the fringe. Dantalina took the stage next, followed by the fun Gallardia cowl. Then we had the beautiful Galatea top, which is the crochet version of the Panapea top. We started off May with the beautiful Andante shawl, and then had the really fun and cozy pocket shawl named Ray. The textured Earth Mother scarf was next, followed by the beautiful Sunset Diamonds shawl. That, along with the gorgeous Alpen Glow that came next, made for some super fun summer stitch alongs. In June, we released the delightful Colette cardigan and vest, which is just so adorable, followed by the stunning Arazzo shawl with its beautiful color work. For a super fun, lightweight top, try Proserpina. After that, we re-released our super easy Mind the Gap tube scarf, and then we introduced Carencia, a super soft, textured blanket in which we used all kinds of different yarn bases. We ended the month with our beautiful Sweet Pea shawl and Pascal tank. For July, we started the month off with the incredible Automus Triangle Shawl inspired by diamonds. Then we had the cute cover-up called Makani, followed by the really adorable shrug named Curtsy. Then we introduced the really beautiful gradient pullover named Millie Fiori, followed by the beautiful pie shawl Circumfractal. August began with the amazing Rias Duster, followed by an updated version of our Pineapple Sunset cover-up. The Soothing Dichondra was next, followed by a remake of our popular Love and Lace shawl. You all loved the beaded Zucchero shawl so much, and the Azarella cardigan. We showed a remake of our Destiny blanket and introduced the Skyfather scarf. Conjure was our first pattern in September, a cozy blanket with all kinds of stitch patterns to learn. Next was the gorgeous gradient poncho Muisca, followed by the magical teal tenacity shawl. 
Cabochon with its fun baubles was next, followed by the beautiful colorwork pullover Asteri. Almond Flowers was the final pattern for that month with its unique Tunisian crochet stitches. Moving on to October, we introduced our incantation blanket, which is the crochet version of Conjure. The Levanter scarf and cowl set was next, followed by the jaw-dropping, pottery-inspired Hemez sweater. Then we re-released our blanket for you pattern, followed by the cozy gradient capullo cocoon shrug. Then we had the Kaveri cowl, which has beautiful cables. We introduced Charlotte, which has beautiful web designs running around. And next we had the soft and fluffy fog bow cowl. November started off with the lovely Dash IL triangle shawl, and then we had the gorgeous Kalina shawl with its little hills and valleys and pup stitches. After that, we showed off a stunning remake of our luxurious blanket, followed by the beautiful new Rainier shawl. Then we had a beautiful remake of our harbor cowl in a stunning three color gradient. In December, we introduced the really beautiful blue shawl and poncho pattern. Then the striking Tempietto shawl came next with all those gorgeous lacy stitches. Then we had the cabled Aerothorn pattern, followed by the textured cabled Mulipi's poncho. Then we had the Secret Meadow shawl and the Multnomah poncho as beautiful remakes. Also this year, we had our year-long mystery knit along and mystery crochet along, which ran the entire year. They were called Advertence and Multivalence, and it was so much fun watching all of your projects take shape and how you all encouraged each other throughout the entire process. Life truly is better together. And finally, the last pattern of the year, the stunning Royal Shawl by Warda. This is a cape-like shawl. It features a collar with this beautiful little pico edging and delicate leaves in a contrasting shade dripping down the length of the shawl. I also really love the removable shoulders, their fun texture, the leaf design, and their cute little curly tassels. And to make this shawl, we used our soft and dreamy Sincere Sock Yarn. It's a beautiful blend of merino wool and nylon, so it's soft and squishy and it holds up well to lots of love and use. So I would love to know which of all of these patterns is your favorite and what would you love to see for next year? We always love to hear from you. If you would love to get three of these patterns for free, just look in the description. So I hope that was fun for you to see all of those different patterns and hopefully you find some that you love. As we usher in the new year, I am wishing you a beautiful year full of joy, strength, and peace. I look forward to seeing you next year. We have so many beautiful new yarns and patterns planned for you, as well as new year-long mystery knit-alongs and crochet-alongs, so stay tuned for those. Wishing you a magical finish to this year and I will see you next year. Bye!